time you raise your car's manufacturer affinity level, you receive a credits reward. Congratulations, you've successfully completed the qualifying series. Welcome to the Super Street volume. Let's learn more about the cars of Super Street. For most of us, our first, and sometimes only, taste of racing comes on the streets. If you love cars, this is where it all starts. In the empty parking areas, and on the city streets where you race your mates between stoplights. We do this in the very first cars we owned, or the ones we saved up for later. Then we fiddled with the engines and the suspension until they went faster, and added stripes and stickers so they looked faster too. It's the same around the world. Whether it's on Japanese mountain roads, on Britain's back lanes, or America's super highways. We're talking about affordable heroes. Cars that bring performance to the people. Whether they're smoking around a parking lot or hammering along a city circuit you designed yourself. They aren't the most expensive, and they won't win every drag race. But they all prove one thing. You don't need a million dollars to have a car with a big heart. Each volume contains three series. You'll get to choose which car you'll use for each one. You are now entered in the Challenger series. Each circuit in this series will challenge different aspects of your car and your skill as a driver. Let's go choose what kind of car you'll be driving. Each division contains a group of cars from a specific car subculture. Select one of the highlighted divisions below to choose a car from its roster. Japan, home of the noble art of drifting. Made famous by cult movies, manga comics and console games, all of which celebrated the street racers who baited... This is your 2003 Nissan Team Forza Fairlady Z. You're all set up to race in the Super Street Challenger Series. Let's go.
Use Message Center to stay up to date on the goings on in the world of Forza Motorsport. This is your 1999 Nissan Skyline GTR Fast and Furious Edition. Thank you. 